As a small eastern Kentucky town is still dealing with a shocking crime. The murder of a Letcher County judge and the arrest of the sheriff charged with that murder. Gil McClanahan is in Whitesboro with more tonight. Four days after the tragic murder, this small eastern Kentucky community is still trying to come to terms with what happened here and why. Just shaking. Even though life is slowly returning to normal, the pain of what happened is still very real in Whitesburg. Throughout the downtown area, there are signs of fall as the town gets ready for the annual Mountain Heritage Festival. Organizers hope the event is a time of healing. We felt that having the festival would bring people together and um, the festival is always known as a homecoming. Well, I've never thought uh, anything would like this would have happened. Letcher County Circuit Court Clerk Mike Watts has known both the suspect Sheriff Mickey Steins and the victim Judge Kevin Mullins for more than 20 years. He was at the courthouse at the time of the shooting. How are you putting this into perspective? I can't. I can't. Why? I, it's just unbelievable, unreal, unimaginable. Having this hit our doorstep has been uh, has been very impactful. Jensen Riddle, pastor of First Baptist Church of Whitesburg, says he told his congregation to reach out to all involved to help in the healing process. But most of all, he is telling people to pray. There's a lot of confusion about what happened. A lot of, um, there's all sorts of rumors that go around. But really, the, at the end of the day, there are, there are two families that are in deep, deep anguish and pain. On Wednesday, Sheriff Steins will be arraigned in Carter County on the charge of first-degree murder. In Letcher County, Kentucky, Gil McClanahan, Eyewitness News. Thanks for watching. Here's another video from Eyewitness News. And click here to subscribe to our channel to get the latest.